Game 5 in the Western Conference Semifinals. The Nuggets find themselves in a postseason deadlock at two games apiece. It is a critical turning point, and they know the time is now as they face a pivotal Game 5 against the Timberwolves. Round 2 of the NBA playoffs continue. Coming right up. Here comes Game 5 of the Western Conference Semifinals on 2K Sports. Either one of these teams could grab the series lead tonight. Hello, everyone. I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg. We'll hear from reporter Allie LaForce in a moment. So, the opening lineup for the Timberwolves. Conley at the guard with Edwards next to him. Inside, we got Towns and Gobert. And it's McDaniels in at the small forward. And for Denver, manning the backcourt, it's Murray and KCP. Gordon and Jokic the combo inside. And it's Porter in at the small forward position. Here we go, the Timberwolves on the run. Pass to Edwards. Here's Gobert. Gobert is doubled for three. Conley on target from range. Gobert can look over the top of just about any defense right there. Delivers a nice pass. To the wing on the left. Outside quarter. Three-pointer. The shot is good on the assist by Jokic. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you can fire three of your own. Boom. Now here's Edwards. Down low. Oh, and Gobert powers it home. Excellent mobility right there. I like when Gobert rolls to the rim with that aggression. Caldwell Pope against Edwards. Here's Murray. Pass to Jokic. Here's Caldwell Pope. And the Nuggets hit again from deep. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Now here's Conley. Towns is screened on Murray. Conley passes to Towns. And here's Edwards outside. Jokic grabs the board. Denver has gone two of two at the perimeter to Porter Jokic with it over Edwards Caldwell Pope the pass to Gordon and it's all from three point range for Minnesota they've gone two of three from the floor now here's Conley and the first quarter of action two minutes in Edwards for three knocks down the long Jays you know Edwards is still tweaking his three point shot but he sure looked good there Conley against Murray. Pass to Jokic. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Defensive foul. Murray Gobert. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. At the line for your Nuggets, Nikola Jokic. One shot. Whatever this team needs from Jokic, he seems to provide it because he works so hard. Whether it's points, passing, rebounding, improved defensively, love his determination. Now here's Conley. Pass to McDaniel. Back to Towns. Beyond the arc. Denver grabs the miss. Jokic passes to Murray. 
to the paint. Here's Porter. And it's rebounded by Carl Anthony Towns. And so it's Conley who brings up the ball for the T-Wolves. They trail by one. And here in the first, about three minutes in. Outside Edwards. Six on the shot clock. Towns outside. Fires for three. The rebound by Murray. The Nuggets have gone three of six from the floor. To the inside. Here's Gordon. And Gordon with the big finish. Nobody does it better than Gordon on the alley-oop. Boom! Conley against Murray. The shot by Conley. No good. For Denver, they've gone four of seven, shooting a solid percentage. Jokic with a screen on Conley. Murray with it. And it's Gobert picking him up. Murray, shot is good. Well, the contact not affecting Murray one bit. This guy is a really naturally strong player. Edwards looking for an opening. Gobert with a screen on Caldwell Pope. And here's Edwards outside. Nikola Jokic grabs the miss. Jokic has got four rebounds now. Outside Murray. Back to Jokic. Outside, Caldwell Pope. The shot is good on the assist by Jokic. Jokic has got his third assist of the night. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Now a timeout called by Minnesota. with it. Now Porter defending. Conley against Murray. Towns outside. They get back on track. It's hauled in by the Nuggets. He had more than enough room to hit that. Just couldn't make it happen. Pass to Jokic. Launches a three. And another three for Denver. Outstanding long range shooting here early. They already have hit multiple shots from downtown. Bring music scorching those nets. How long can they keep this up, though? Now here's Edwards. Inside, Gobert. Ooh, the lead pass was in the perfect spot to set up the layup. Gobert's got his second basket of the game. Best of luck to any defender trying to slow Gobert down. He is ruthless inside. Pass to Jokic. Over Gobert. That one rolls around and rims out. Good idea with the fadeaway, but the defense was just all over it. Conley finds Edwards. Baseline try. The shot, no good. Excellent D there from Caldwell Pope. It's been that kind of quarter for him. The shot has just been unreliable. There's the drive. And here's Jokic outside. And it's rebounded by Carl Anthony Towns. The Timberwolves trail. And here's Conley. Pass to Towns. Yes, great play by Conley to set it up. Hey, he's used to that. I mean, teams try to be physical with Towns and body him up, beat him up, but he's a little too strong for that to bother. Now here's Murray. Over Conley. Murray, shot is good. And they've settled in quickly today. A nice flow and rhythm to their offense. Yeah, they're lasered in. I mean, really making the most of their possessions. Conley against Murray. Outside McDaniels. Pass to Towns. Up and over Porter. Towns gets the bucket. Towns is so dangerous in the paint. 
He's got the ability to just muscle through most any defense. And here's Jokic. And Gobert with a block. Well, I don't think there's any question about it. They came focused and ready to play. I mean, they're doing everything they can to um, put things in their favor. You earn that, and they're actually earning it well right now. Got an advantage there off the pick and took it right in. They have no answer defensively inside. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. All right, well, a look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for the Nuggets. You know, right from the start, it seemed they got hot from three-point range, pulling apart the defense and racking up the points, too. Man, they're just having their way, bullying the other team in the painted area, imposing their will down there whenever they want. And that one falls for Gobert. And, you know, night to night, you pretty much know what you're going to get from Gobert. Rim protection, rebounding, intensity. And he gets his points within the flow of the offense. That's a valuable guy there. Jordan, pass to Porter. Stolen by Conley. And now the T-Wolves on the break. With the floater. The rebound by Murray. And so Murray will bring it up for the Denver Nuggets. Four-point game. From 17... The rebound by the Timberwolves. Towns has got rebound number five here tonight. Pass to Alexander Walker. Back to Daniel. Basket's good. Here's Caldwell Pope. He's got six. Now here's Jordan. to Murray oh and makes it with the kiss Murray's got six you know big guys like Jordan who can facilitate are really valuable spots the open man and gets it right to him Towns outside Murray against Conley here's Gobert just five to shoot and Jamal Murray picks up the foul. That's his first foul of the game for the Nuggets. Watson, he's checked in for Gordon. Brown comes in for Michael Porter. And it's Jackson in for Caldwell Pope. Here's Alexander Walker, defended by Jackson. Reed a screen on Jackson. Shot clock at six. And there's contact and a whistle. So he's got two shots coming up. Throws good. Second free throw, no good. Denver in the lead. Pass to Jordan. Now Jackson. Anderson covers. Jackson. Pass to Murray. Jordan with it. Jackson for three. Reed with the rebound. That's excellent defense right there on the perimeter. Alexander Walker. Morris finds Anderson. Towns looking for an opening. On the wing, Alexander Walker. That's in. Coming off an assist from Towns. 
And it's a tie ball game. Nice vision that time from Towns. And you know, he's got that skill set. Pass to Jordan. Outside Murray. Banked it in off the glass. Murray's got eight. And the Timberwolves with possession. They're on a 15-6 run. The fadeaway. Denver grabs the miss. Here's Watson. He's scoreless. There's Jackson with the three. Counted from distance. And the Nuggets lead by five. So assertive at the arc. Jackson will not hesitate to take the shot. That's good from Towns. On the assist from Morris. He just brings a great feel for the game at the offensive end. Jordan, the screen. Murray for three. And he drains it. A solid five for six now. And they've got the D really. A full three-point attack right off the tip. When that happens, you simply just hope they start cooling off. Morris for three. Sinks it. What range from downtown. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. Here's Watson. Outside Murray. Jackson with room to fire. Reed with the rebound. Boy, the defense got lucky there with him missing. But they don't want to chance that again. And the whistle on the shot. Got some contact there. Misses the shot, but he'll shoot two. And the foul called on the Denver Nuggets. the first. Nikola Jokic has checked in for the Nuggets. Holiday comes in for Jamal Murray. And the Timberwolves also making a change. Edwards has checked in. Both free throws good from Morris. Making it look effortless. Send this guy to the strike. He's going to cash in more than not. Pass to Watson. Jokic with a screen on Anderson. Watson passes to Jokic. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. Jokic has got eight. This is exactly how you should use Jokic in these situations. Feed that beast inside. Edwards against Holiday. Outside Edwards. There's the triple. Hits the trifecta. He has six. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. It's all tied in Denver. And back to the start of the second quarter in just a moment. 33. Continuing our coverage of the Western Conference semifinals. Glad to have you back. All right, guys, what do you think about the Nuggets here in this one? Well, it looks like hitting the boards hard was an emphasis of their attack. They knew how valuable it was to do so. Yeah, and you know, when a team establishes an edge on the glass early, it really sets things up for the rest of the game. And so Morris will bring it up for the Timberwolves. Setting the floor for the Timberwolves. We've got Edwards. 
Nikhil Alexander Walker out there with Kyle Anderson. Then it's Monte Morris, and it's Reed in at the center position. One of the trickier plays to judge, but it would be hard to argue against the call. Yeah, you know, the officials aren't nearly as lenient as they used to be on that call. As a matter of fact, I know I got away with a lot of those in my playing days, but that was 40 years ago. Jackson, the pass to Jokic. Look at Jokic going to work inside. And it's Jackson's responsibility to find his open teammates in a terrific dime there. Minnesota has got five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. Jackson against Morris. Right side, Edwards. Anderson passes to Alexander Walker. Five to shoot. Reed sets the screen. Puts it up from 17. The shot by Alexander Walker, no good. You know, you'd like to see a little more effort there defensively, but maybe they wanted him to take that shot, baited him into it. <laughs> and when the game is this close, you have to go all out. He certainly understands his role, huh? When the shot goes up, just crashes the offensive glass. You know, that time I thought he did it with authority. Tremendous putback at a time when they really need it. It is. There's no reason to back off and give him the layup. Much better off making him go to the line. Following for the Timberwolves, Anthony Edwards. Two shots. They throw good, Edwards. So much confidence coming from Anthony Edwards. You can just see it. This is a guy who knows he belongs in the league and is hungry to be great. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Denver has gotten six of ten three-pointers to drop. Jackson against Morris. Jackson attacking. Oh, Jokic hammers it home. An impressive seeing Jokic go off like this. I mean, you can tell his teammates are being energized by what he's doing. Jackson against Morris. It's Edwards on the wing. Give him eight. Down to five on the shot clock. over Jackson. Edwards can't hit. You've got to love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. I certainly do. You know I like to see guys do their work inside. Their rebounding has been excellent, and that's always important in a close game. Now here's Jokic. 12 points for him. Jackson gets the bucket. Such a savvy passer. Jokic is patient and gets quality openings for his teammates. Edwards against Holiday. Fades back. Up again. Pass to Alexander Walker. Reed sets a screen. From downtown, pure from three point range. Not sure what the defense was thinking. I mean, you can't leave this guy open from deep. Jackson outside. for Denver. The jumper is so consistent for Jackson. He's got a great touch on his shot and good accuracy as well. Morris against Jackson. Morris outside. Back to Anderson. The three ball. Count it. And it's Morris with the assist. Anderson's got his first three points of the game. Slow reaction from the D, and it cost him three. Here's Jackson. Shot blocked. Jackson against Anderson. Closing in on four minutes played here in the second quarter. Reed to screen on Jackson. Pass to Reed from the arc. Rebound by the Nuggets. They've led by as many as 11. Here's Watson to the middle. Here's Jokic. 
And that bucket makes him six for ten in the contest. And now almost all their points coming from the paint. Timeout call, the Timberwolves. You look at Nikola Jokic. What a contribution. Boy, he's been killing them all night, and the defense looks like it's practically packed it in. Gordon comes in for Watson, and Caldwell Pope is subbed in for Holiday. Gobert's checked in for the Timberwolves. Conley comes in for Alexander Walker.
glass. What a quarter. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? Well, Carl, they're scoring pretty easily. What has to change in the second half? Our whole defensive system right now because it's just not working. It's not the coaches, it's just his players. They're letting them get too much fast break. Uh, they're doing a great job and uh, they're hitting some shots, so we got to be able to make a miss. Best of luck locking it in, guys. All right, Allie, thanks for that. We will see everyone right back after this break, ready for the second half. And we thank you for joining this postseason broadcast, and it's been an outstanding first half for the Denver Nuggets. Offensively, they're facing no resistance on the interior. So they just continue to grind away. You see the high quality shots that they're getting? That's a very disciplined approach. And the defensive response to that might be to collapse the lane, but then you could leave perimeter shooters open. So which would you prefer? An interesting postseason for the Nuggets. They've got a chance to retake a lead in the series and a hometown crowd eager to help them do it. You're right, home court advantage could be the difference maker. Time to make that move. A pretty balanced series so far. Both teams have proven they can win games. So who knows what will happen? Not me. Appreciate you joining us. It's been our distinct pleasure, and I mean that. Let's now take you back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. Let's get you back onto the court for more of this pivotal Game 5. It's been a clinic out there by Nikola Jokic. And given that he's just delivered a double-double through two quarters, I'm excited to see his stats at the end of the night. Yeah, he's got that locked-in look in his eyes tonight, and he's not going to start taking it easy. I think he's going to be going hard until that final whistle blows. And the forward spots, Porter Jr. and Gordon. Manning the backcourt, it's Murray and KCP. And it's Jokic in at the center position. That's the group on the floor for Denver. Now here's Conley. Misses the three. Used the pump fake well, but he couldn't capitalize. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10 rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. Back to Jokic over Conley. And it's Jokic missing. Clean look from mid-range. Coach will probably want to run that play again. Caldwell Pope against Edwards. Gordon with a steal. Left side Porter. And out of bounds. Minnesota will have it. So it's Edwards who brings up the ball for the T-Wolves. They haven't given up any points here in the second half. Can't connect from 13 feet out. And stolen by Edwards. Pass to Gobert. Towns for three. Ooh, and once again, off the mark by Minnesota. They've been unable to hit anything this half. Three attempts and three misses. Passes to Porter. Now here's Gordon. Takes a three. That one drops. And it comes off an assist from Porter. Gordon's got his second bucket of the night. Man, I like seeing Gordon stretch his range a little bit. I mean, the three-point shot is still a work in progress for him, but I think he's only going to get better the more experience he gets shooting it from there. McDaniels, that's good. And, you know, after starting 0 for 3 this half, they finally get one down. Murray against Conley. Murray inside. That one's good. Seven for ten now. You know, when Murray finishes like this, guys, it shows you how aggressive his mindset is in attacking the defense. 
Jones is screen on Murray. Here's Conley with the drive, and it's rejected. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. Yeah, rebounding has been a big key in this one. They've asserted their will and have taken control on the glass. Now here's Caldwell Pope. He's got 11. Some solid defense from Edwards. Well, we talk about the value of great rim protection. That's a shot he typically makes. Oh, he muscles it in through the contact. They call the foul, and he's on his way to the line. Well, McDaniels wasn't going to be denied there. Getting the bucket and has a chance for one more. Nuggets have gotten two of four shots to go since the break. Outside Porter. Pass to Murray. Oh, he hits that one. Eight for 11 and remaining a thorn in the D side. Boy, on nights like this, it seems like Murray is playing that defense like a song. He can make it a long night for the opponent. Back to Conley. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Conley's got 10 points in the game. He can really read the floor. Precision pass in rhythm. Jokic to screen. Murray from outside. It's blocked by Gobert. No surprise Gobert sent that shot back. Conley against Caldwell Pope. And here's Edwards outside. Denver grabs the miss. Porter's got four rebounds now. The scoring efficiency has been low, and it's not helping them on the scoreboard. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. And you know that's how it goes with him. I mean, his hot streaks, guys, don't last minutes. They last days. Now here's Edwards. Ten points for him. And there's the foul. It'll go on Aaron Gordon. That's his first foul. It's time to take a glance again at that superb block. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Here's Edwards. Towns outside. Gobert with a screen on Gordon. Six to shoot. Towns passes to Gobert. Get out of Gobert's way. Making a play right there. Gobert just using his size. The Nuggets have gotten four of seven shots to drop in the third. Outside Murray. Up and over Conley. Murray, no good. Minnesota's gone one of four here in the third from range. Murray against Conley. Kick out to Edwards. And he lobs it up. And Gordon with the big finish. Yeah, first and foremost, he's a pass-first team player. It's called Will Pope. Love seeing that. Conley against Murray. Pass to Towns. Rebound by the Nuggets. Porter's got his fifth rebound in this one. Now Murray. Jokic with a screen on Edwards. Murray finds Jokic. Porter with it. Outside Murray. Just five on the clock. Jokic against Gobert. Jokic shot is good. Jokic has got 24 points. Jokic embraces the pressure. He's terrific at keeping his composure and maintaining the cool head even when the shot clock is up against him. Now here's McDaniels. Outside Edwards. Inside. And he throws it down with one hand. You see McDaniels setting the pick and then finding a soft spot in the defense on his way to the basket. That's good work. Pass to Jokic. 
for Gobert. And it's rebounded by Carl Anthony Towns. Towns has got eight rebounds in the game. Looking to get it going. Shot is good by Edwards. Edwards got 12 points in the game. Built like a linebacker, Edwards is not your average off guard, folks. Caldwell Pope, the pass to Murray. Back to Caldwell Pope. To the inside. Here's Porter. Oh, rejected by McDaniels. The length of McDaniels, a big factor at both ends. Browns checked in for the Nuggets. Alexander Walker, he's checked in for the Timberwolves. Here's Jokic. 24 points for him. Four on the clock. From behind the arc. Caldwell Pope's shot is off. The Timberwolves have gotten six of their first 12 shots to drop in this third. Outside Conley. Pass to Towns. The three is up. Yes. Great play by Conley to set it up. Three. Conley's got eight assists in the game. I do not think you can overstate Towns' range. I mean, he takes a tough shot there and makes it look easy. Fires it. Murray's shot is good. Murray's got 23 points. Yeah, this period, they're letting him go to work, and it's paying off. Towns outside. Pass to Alexander Walker. And the Timberwolves hit again from deep. And what's working here, each guy is willing to make the next pass. Murray from outside. And it's rebounded by Carl Anthony Towns. Towns has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Jacks up a three. And the Timberwolves hit again from deep. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. I think they're playing too soft on the perimeter. They can't stay so soft. They've got to get up into the shooters here. Now here's Jokic. Got it. Good job in the low post. Jokic has got four points now in the quarter. They're not rolling like they were earlier. The bucket's a little harder to come by. Yeah, the game has a bit of a different texture than it did just a little bit ago. Suddenly, that lead is not looking as comfy and cozy as it once did. Denver has gone two for five from three since halftime. Murray against Conley. Pass to Gordon. Over Towns, and he can't bank that one in. More often than not, he'll cash it in from that area. The defense might have done just enough to bother him. Tries again, and he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It's on Nikola Jokic. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Denver. They feel like they have an advantage inside, and so far they have done an excellent job exploiting it. And, you know, the more they penetrated, the more they realized the defense wasn't able to stop them. Shoot, shoot. So they just kept doing it. And he can't get the first one. A different look for Denver. Jordan's checked in for Jokic. Watson comes in for Gordon. And it's Jackson in for Caldwell Pope. on the second one. Denver in the lead. Jackson surveying the D. Pass to Murray. Morris against Jackson. Clock at six. Here's Watson. Let's it go from deep. Towns with a rebound. Takes a step back. Morris against Murray. Morris.
first passes to Alexander Walker. Another miss by Minnesota. You know how good a shooter he is. It's frustrating for him when he's not able to knock down that kind of wide open look. And slam dunk by Jordan. Boy, somehow, someway, you've got to keep Jordan away from the basket because if you allow him to get it there, he's flushing. Here's Anderson. The Nuggets getting their last shot to go. Out to the wing. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. <laughs> no debate there. He got ample. Blatant contact. Straightforward call. Shooting simple. Kyle Anderson taking two shots. Free throw, no good. And he sinks the second. And so it's Murray who brings up the ball for Denver. Pass to Jordan. Back to Murray. Now Jackson. They kick it out to Murray. Jordan with a screen on Morris. Here's Murray. Oh, and Reed with a block. And he gets it back. Jackson gets the bucket. Minnesota's got four of eight attempts to fall from deep here in the third quarter. Towns is screen on Murray. Morris finds Anderson. Here's Alexander Walker. Now here's Towns. Defended by Murray. Outside, Anderson. Six on the shot clock. The shot by Towns. No good. That's exactly the look they wanted, guys. Right guy, right play. Wrong result. They kick it out to Murray. Anderson pulls it down. Boy, great effort on defense there against a guy who typically makes that. Morris outside. Pass to Towns. There's 18 seconds left in the third quarter. Morris outside. And there's Towns on the assist from Morris. Morris has got three assists tonight. Right now, Towns is putting on a show. It's up to the defense to try to figure out how to slow him down. And so it's the Denver Nuggets leading by six as we selection right now. Keeping the game simple and getting high percentage looks. More NBA on 2K Sports right after this. All right, let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. You know, I'm kind of stoked that this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. Yeah, and with the accuracy to go along with that vision. I mean, he put the ball in the absolute perfect spot. That's how you orchestrate it. And it's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. On the court for the Timberwolves. They've got Monte Morris. Kyle Anderson is out there with Nikhil Alexander-Walker. Then there's Edwards. And it's Reed in at the center position. Too big, too skilled. Jokic just methodically breaks you down. He's a very unique player. Two shots.
Free throw drops for Jokic. The Timberwolves making a switch here. Warren's checked in. So he picks up just one from the line that time. The Timberwolves trail. Down low. Here's Edwards. And Edwards slams it in. Hey, T.J. Warren is definitely a scorer. He's got a shoot-first mentality. But he'll give it up if you're open. Jackson against Morris. Jackson pass to Jokic. Oh, Jokic powers it in. Absolutely ruthless. He's not about to start showing mercy now. Guys, when you're this hot, it's elementary. Let it fly. Keep staying at it. Outside Warren. Jokic grabs the board. Jokic has got 13 rebounds in the game. Glass heating. Pass to Holiday. Let's the three fly. Minnesota with a rebound. Anderson's got four rebounds now. Morris outside. Outside Edwards. Morris a screen on Holiday. Here's Edwards. And it's Denver with a rebound. At one point, they led by 16. We've made our way through just over a minute and a half of this fourth quarter. Jackson, pass to Jokic. Back to Jackson. Five on the clock. Watson. Yes! And a nice assist from Jackson. And it's a 10-point Denver lead. Now you have to extend that defense. I mean, you really have to stay connected to him at all times. Yeah, especially with the score being what it is. I mean, you got to tighten it up on the Now here's Anderson. Here's the three. Sinks the tray. Nice read by Edwards there, finding a wide open teammate and sending the ball his way on target. Holiday taking his time here. Pass to Jackson. Outside Holiday. This one for three. Second chance shot. The big time strength of Jokic. He's certainly been their go-to guy when it matters most. He's trying to close this one out. For Minnesota, they've gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. Morris passes to Warren. Soft touch off the glass. Warren's got his first points of the night. Well, I tell you what, I love watching Warren match the defense's intensity and still be able to convert. This is a hard-nosed, really good offensive player. Now here's Jokic. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. It's going to be on Nas Reed. Man, good whistle there. Yeah, you can hear the smack all the way over here where we are. It's Jokic. Two shots. The first one falls. Caldwell Pope's checked in for Denver. Pickett comes in for Jackson. Garza's checked in for Minnesota. Conley comes in for Warren. And Jokic drops them both. Now here's Edwards. Out to the right wing. Conley looking for an opening. Outside Edwards. And Edwards slams it in. The strength of Edwards, confident in taking on defenders and finishing. Here's Pickett. He's guarded by Conley. There's a screen from deep. Nails it from beyond the arc. Pickett's got himself on the board with a three there. 
got to fight harder to get over those screens. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays in. Three finds Morris. Excellent D there from Caldwell Pope. They really have a commanding lead, not just in points, but in rebounds as well. And what I like about it, it's been a physical brand of basketball. It's had a little sandpaper element to it. Gritty and rough, but that's how you win games. Minnesota with the ball, following the score by Denver. Outside Conley. Inside. That one's good from Morris on the assist by Edwards. This has been the story of the game, a battle fought on offense. Any lull in the action so far has been short-lived because there have been nothing but buckets in this one. Now here's Jokic. And it's good. Fought through contact, hit the shot, and will go to the line. Jackson, he's checked in for Pickett. And the Timberwolves also making a change. Anderson's checked in. That's his first personal foul. The Timberwolves have gone five of eight from the field so far in the fourth. The three. That one's good. And it's Conley who picks up the assist. Conley's got 10 assists here tonight. So active for the Nuggets. Gordon comes in for Watson. And Murray subbed in for Jackson. Gobert's checked in for Minnesota. Carl Anthony Towns comes in for Morris. Brings up the ball for Denver. At one point, they led by 16. No good. A bit long that time. Minnesota's gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. Anderson finds Conley. Edwards with it. Pass to Towns. Towns double team. Anderson for three. Towns passes to Gobert. Back to Towns. And it's going to be a three-second call. That's a costly error. Well, let's see how they bounce back. Well, you know what? Their wounds are self-inflicted. I mean, you've got to play much smarter than that. Morris, he's checked in for Anderson. And here's Murray. Pass to Jokic. And looks like an illegal pick was set. That gets the ref's attention. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Yeah, I agree. You know, sometimes that can be a tough call for the refs to make, but not that time. It was easy there. Now here's Edwards. Out to the right wing. Double team on Towns. Morris for three. That one's good. And it's Towns with the assist. Towns has got six assists now in the game. Conley against Murray. Here's Jokic. And again, Denver no good. The Timberwolves have gone 7 for 11 so far in the fourth. Morris. And it's good for two. And now just a four-point Denver lead. A really nice rhythm to his game here late. I mean, he's hit three out of four this quarter and looks to put his team over the top. Murray with it. And it's Gobert picking him up from deep. Jokic. Oh, almost had a four-point play right there. But he'll go to the line with a chance for three. Hey, nice work attracting the foul from deep. He'll shoot three. You have to avoid fouls like that. As a defender, challenge the three-point shooter, but run by him, not into him. And he hits the first of three. And the Nuggets making a change here. Porter Jr.'s checked in. The Timberwolves also with a sub. McDaniels is checked in for Morris. Oh, 
and he's good on the second. I love the intensity he's brought to the floor since halftime in constant attack mode. And he makes all three. The Timberwolves have gone 8 of 12 so far here in the fourth. Pass to Towns. Yes, great play by Conley to set it up. Towns has got 10 points here in the second half. They're making smart adjustments, setting guys up for success. It's certainly been an impressive run. They finally found the right formula to break down the defense. Now here's Murray to the middle. Here's Jokic. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Jokic has got 41. He's going off this quarter. A huge reason why this team is on top. Time called here. The Timberwolves decide to talk it over. Keeping us updated from the sideline, Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Chris Finch was going over with his team. Coach told them to adjust on defense, saying they're calling it tight right now. We can keep the same effort, but less reaching in and all that. Don't let them beat us at the line. Send it back to you, Brian. And Allie, thanks. Minnesota's gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Conley against Murray. Towns double team. Outside Edwards. Shot clock at six. Over Jokic. Edwards can't hit. And they just continue to dominate the boards. Guys, I think they've simply been the more physical team, and that's why they're ahead. Now here's Murray. Pass to Jokic. They double up Jokic. Murray from outside. The rebound by the Timberwolves. Gobert's got rebound number eight here already in the game. McDaniels against Caldwell Pope. Gobert passes to Edwards. Gobert with a screen on Porter. And here's Edwards outside. Here's Gobert. Oh, easy two for Gobert. And, you know, you give Edwards credit for making the right decision there, feeding his teammate. Smart, good basketball. Jokic with a screen on Conley. Pass to Porter. Now Caldwell Pope. Guarded by Edwards. Murray from outside. Towns with a rebound. Towns has got 14. Yep, 14 rebounds for him tonight. McDaniels. Towns outside. Laid it in with a nice touch off the window. And now just a three-point nugget lead. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. Yeah, you can't say that with enough emphasis. I mean, the defenders are just not being aggressive enough down low. you got to play with some physicality in the paint. Caldwell Pope against Edwards. Launches it. And it's Denver with a rebound. Going into halftime, he had two threes in his pocket, but hasn't added to that total since. Murray passes to Jokic. And the call is going to be, yes, an illegal screen. Well, the league has put an emphasis to crack down on illegal screens. Yeah, you know, he might have gotten away with that a few years ago, but not anymore. No way. Now you've got to be stationary on those screens. No extra hips or elbows, or they'll call it. Now a timeout called by Minnesota. You look at Nikola Jokic. What a contribution. And he's getting to the rack all game, and if they can't do a better job of keeping him out of the paint, they're in for a long night.
Here's Gobert. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Guys like McDaniels, who can guard just about any position on the floor, extremely valuable these days. Two shots. First one falls for him. He's perfect from the line this time. Denver in the lead. Pass to Jokic. And here's Murray. Here's Jokic. Defended by Gobert. Jokic, no good. And so it's Conley who brings up the ball for the Timberwolves. And Edwards slams it in. At every level, Edwards has been the go-to guy for his team. It's in his DNA. To the paint. Here's Jokic. Yes. And it's Murray picking up the assist. Jokic has got 43 points. When it's an important possession, Jokic steps up big. blows it's going to be on Anthony Edwards that's his first foul of the game I love great defense just quick to establish his feet and he takes the hit and not afraid to put his body on the line either he took a shot for the team in that situation now here's Murray pass to Jokic out to Gordon for three he drops it from range. Now it's a six-point Denver lead. Well, I like the confidence here. Gordon is excellent at realizing when he has room to shoot even before he has the ball. That's what we call seeing a play ahead. Now here's Edwards. Pick Michael Bear. Shot from 12. And that's out of bounds. Last touch by Jokic. <laughs> Side Edwards. Six to shoot. Money. And now they trail by just four. Seems like Edwards never stops competing and believing right until the final buzzer. To the inside. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Rudy Gobert picks one up. So the first one drops. And that puts him up five. And so both free throws good. And it's a six-point ball game. You know, important for him to come through at the line there because they want to expand that lead. Edwards against Caldwell Pope. The kick out to Conley. No good with the triple. And the shooter had very little space on that attempt. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high-impact defense they want to see out of him. And they go to the intentional foul. Teams in the the line He hits the first one. 
And that makes it a seven-point lead. And when healthy, Murray is a force, a force to be reckoned with because he can go get baskets against tough defense, and he can also make plays for others. So he gets them both, and it's an eight-point ball game. And just not enough time for them to get back in this game. Not by a long shot. It's all but official. Tipped away. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the official signal a jump ball here. Conley against Caldwell Pope. Pass to Gordon. Outside Porter. Murray with it. Now Jokic. So the Nuggets win it. And with this win, they've piled all the pressure. They only need one more victory to close the series out. And this was a critical performance. And 2-2, a team season can ride on a game five like this one. They did a terrific job of rising to the moment and taking control of the series. All right, let's send it down to Ali LaForce, who's with our player of the game. Nicola, a great game for you tonight. Are nights like tonight even more enjoyable when you put up huge numbers individually? Uh, I'm going to take a W, to be honest. I mean, that's what we all play for, uh, for the wins. Fans coming for the wins. And uh, we came out and played really good basketball tonight. And hopefully we're going to continue. Always such a team player. Back to you guys. Allie, thank you as always. Time for us to say goodbye. We hope you enjoyed our second round coverage of the NBA Western Conference playoffs. For Grant Hill, Ali LaForce, and Clark Kellogg, this is Brian Anderson thanking you all for tuning in tonight. And as we leave, we give you our New Balance player of the game, Nikola Jokic.